how are you doing? Great. I was wondering if you would like to go to the dance with me. Uh-uh. You want to take my man to the dance? You got to go through me first. <laughs> Come here, baby. <laughs> you see, that's why I stopped going to the gym. <clears throat> why is it so easy for him? We've been broken up for one week, and he already has another girlfriend. Oh, Dawn, she's not his girlfriend. She's just a rebound. Well, whatever she is, Al is not going to the dance with her. Brittany, thank you so much for helping me with the dance posters. Oh, no problem, Dawn. You know... I think it's really cool that you and Al are still friends, even though you broke up. Yeah, well, it's hard not to be friends with him, you know? He's a really great guy. Oh, and so sweet. Yeah. Romantic. Yeah. Oh, the way he kisses. We're done, Brittany. <laughs> Don Tartikoff here? Oh, that's me. Well, it's about time. I've been running all over the school here for two hours. This uh, baby's breath don't last forever, you know? Thank you very much. Hey, you know something? You look a little familiar. Bye-bye. No, I'm just saying, I think... So. Okay, shh. <laughs> hey, look, these are from Al. Al? Yeah, he still sends me flowers. But if you ask him about it, he'll just deny it. He is so cute. I guess you two are still pretty close, then. Yeah. But don't worry about it. I mean, he is totally into you. At least that's what he told me last night at the movies. Wait a minute. He told me he was just hanging at home. I know. I know. Al! <laughs> Would you excuse me a minute? Oh, sure. Hey, take as much time as you need. <laughs> Okay, boys, welcome to your first tribal council meeting. Now, before I reveal who you voted out of the park, tell me how your first night was. It was horrible, Miss Logan. Absolutely horrible. I mean, we didn't, we didn't sleep, we didn't eat. Speak for yourself, man. Eltran and I had a delicious meal, Miss Nova. <laughs> hey, what's so good about earthworms? The dirt filling. They're like nature's little Twinkies. <laughs> I am cold, wet, and starving. Can we get this over with? Oh, all right. Okay. The first vote was for Jamal. The second vote was for Jamal. And the third vote doesn't really matter, but it was for, um... Jamal. <laughs> Jamal, you voted for yourself? Yes, I did. Dang, you formed your own alliance. I can't take this no more. I want something good to eat. I want to talk on my cell phone. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, and I want to download MP3s from the net. I want to sync up my electronic black book with my PC. And, oh, yes, I want my MTV. <laughs> the tribe has spoken. <laughs> y'all crazy up in here. Got a brother acting all crazy in the wilderness. I'm a city guy. I have y'all know. <laughs> What'd you say? Oh, yeah, I know. Those fools out there eating twigs right now. And look at me. Look at me. Oh. <laughs> what? I see you here every morning talking to your flapjacks. So, shoot, pass me to catch up and step off, woman. Let me. I swear I never sent Dawn flowers. Shoot. Even when we were going out, I never sent the girl flowers. <laughs> She told me you deny it. What do you mean she told you I deny it? What else did she tell you? That you went to the movies with her last night? What did you see? I know who you cheated on last summer. Hey, look, I... Hey, Jamal. I think it's time we settled this. Bye, Jamal. Hold up, Dawn. What's the deal with you telling Brittany that we went to the movies last night and I'm all buying you flowers and whatnot? I am... Um, well, I... Well, I am nothing. Look, you got my girl all crazy for nothing. Oh, so now she's your girl. Yeah, it took you two months before you started calling me your girl. What are you talking about? Look, that don't mean anything. Yeah, just like our relationship didn't mean anything. Because if it did, you wouldn't be dating someone so quickly. What? Yes, Dawn, listen. I'm not going to justify listen, myself Dawn, to you. I, I'm sorry. 
Yo, Britt. Hey, hey, where are you going? Away. Look, it's obvious that the two of you still have feelings for each other. No, no we, we don't. don't. Well, well, until you settle this, we're over. You're happy now. Hey. Hey. Heard what happened at the diner last night. Oh, yeah. Everything blew up. I feel like a total jerk. I guess you aren't prepared for what happens when you break up with someone. You mean Al hurting me? Yeah, no, I don't think I was prepared for that. Oh, Don, he wasn't trying to hurt you. He was just trying to move on. Look, everyone has their own pace, and I just think you should let Al have his. You're right. I know what to do. Brittany? Look, I am really sorry for saying all those things about Al. It's not you, it was just me being jealous. I understand. So, if you guys want to get back together, I will not get in the way. Really? Yeah. <sighs> cool. <laughs> oh, for a while there, I thought I was going to be alone at the dance like a total loser. <sighs> Thanks, Dawn. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> you drunk too much water, huh? I know you want to use the bathroom. Go ahead, go behind the tree. <laughs> oh, man, forget that. Look, whatever you say, you are not going to make me let go of this pine cone. Okay. Niagara Falls. <laughs> Babbling brooks. <laughs> Melting ice. Hey, boys. Boys, thank goodness you're still here. Look, we got a problem. A big, hairy problem. Oh, um, Miss Noble, what's your eyebrows got to do with surviving? <laughs> No, no, I just heard a grizzly bear escape from Central Park Zoo, and he's running around out here somewhere wild. I'm going to call this whole thing off. Oh, Miss Noble, you're going to have to do a lot better than that to make us quit. No, no, boys, look, I'm serious. It's too dangerous to stay in the park. I okay. want you to go home now. Okay, all right, all right, we'll go, we'll go. I mean, leave now. Okay. okay. Man, can you believe her? <laughs> the old bear escaping from the zoo story. <laughs> yeah, we ain't falling for that. That's what I'm talking about. All right, hey, I say we just stay right here and wait for the best man to win. All right, I'm with you. All right, then. <laughs> what was that? Stump. <sighs> wait a minute, that, that was a monster. <laughs> There's a bear behind you. Oh, man, that's the fakest bear suit I've ever seen in my life. That's Miss Noble just playing a prank. <laughs> Look, Miss Noble, I know you're just trying to... We tore our clothes running through the trees from that bear. Yeah. Oh, my, you saw the bear? Yeah, we saw that bear. Shucks, it chased us all the way down to 86 and Lex. <laughs> oh, I feel sorry for that dude at the hot dog stand. Well, thank goodness you boys are all right. Look, I'll go to the Lost and Found and see if I can get you some fresh clothes. Thanks, Miss Hill. How's it going? I'm fine. I mean, I don't know if Al will ever want to talk to me again, but the important thing is, I'm moving on. Now that sounds like the Dawn I know. Dawn, can I talk to you? You really want to talk to me? Yeah. I just want to say thank you for clearing everything up with me and Britt. <laughs> oh, don't thank me. I mean, I'm the one that screwed it up from the very beginning. And by the way, I am really sorry. Look, no matter what you think, our relationship did mean something. It did? Heck yeah. You were my first serious girlfriend. I wrote down everything we did together. You know, when I miss you, sometimes I go back and read about something that we did. 
Do you write in a diary? Shh. Keep that on the deal. Besides, it's called a journal. So, are we friends again? Always, Donnie Dawn. Oh, but when you get a new boyfriend, I get final approval. Okay, when I run over one with my bike, I'll let you know. <laughs> hey, uh, don't you have a date? Yeah. Well, you better go dance with her. Here, this is all I was able to dig up. Miss Noble, the bear behind you. You, you win. Oh, Good. Like I'm supposed to believe that there's a bear behind. You. Next week, a new show on TNBC, Skate. next week on TNBC.